Okay, welcome back to Fun with Fords. I'm Eric. And this video, I am installing this RAM mount laptop computer mount. And I'm showing it already installed because it took me approximately, I'd say an hour or so. And I'm going to put in the entire installation process. Uh, but I'm going to show it at four times speed because uh, it's probably going to be... Uh, it'd be too long for people to watch it at a normal speed. But if you want to, if you want to see the entire thing, you just have to slow it down. But a couple of things I wanted to, uh, to point out on this ram mount. This is the, the plate that that goes into the uh, the seat bolts and then this is the post that mounts to it uh, the instructions say to do this first and then this second but what I found is getting to the bolts under here were rather difficult so if I had to do this over again I would attach this to the seat plate first and then put this and then install this but it's really sturdy and driving down the road this I got this resting on the the armrest it is really sturdy I'm very surprised actually and because I'm putting a, a laptop in the, uh, the the passenger side seat it's it's going to be moderately to very intrusive for a passenger riding here. They'd probably have to scoot all the way over. You'd have to push this all the way in. But it's very convenient to have uh, the the plug-in right here, so I can put the uh, I'll, I'll mount my my power adapter. I'll I'll wrap this up and run the cords right. But so far, I like it. I'll show a view from the other side. Okay, here's. From the driver's side, so you have really close access to a laptop computer, which is very convenient. I want to be able to have access to my computer when I stop, not have to get out, grab up the computer, turn it on, so I can have it right here at my fingertips. And you lose this when you when you set it up and you you rest it up against the. Uh, the center console, you lose the cup holder, but I have access to this, and then I can always swap this over. All right, so here next, I'm going to show the install, and be sure to uh, watch for a video that I inserted uh, in showing when I went trailer shopping. I'll put the uh, the timestamp right in here so you can see it. I'm going to be putting in a RAM mount. It says no drill laptop computer mount. Mounts in the passenger side seat. So I'm going to follow the directions here. I will scan these and I'll put them up. Doesn't look too complicated. So we're going to go ahead and use the glasses again seem to get good comments on these glasses uh, especially with the first person view so here we go all right let's get started no passenger side seat loose and remove two bolts on the seat Fold the seat backwards Seat base. Well, let's find the seat base first. Okay. This should be it. I'm guessing it goes like that. Yep. This is supposed to be a custom fit for the F250, F350. So, we will see. But, just by putting it right here, looks like it's already going to fit. So, okay, let's get these two 
things out and we'll see what we can loosen up. Pretty solid. Alright, that's step one, I guess. Alright, and yeah, building that and putting that together. Alright, while well, I figure out these next few steps, uh, I'm going to uh, insert a video of uh, when I was going trailer shopping not too long ago. And, uh, what I found at a particular trailer reseller was just appalling. So check it out and I'll be right back. Garbage welds. Terrible paint. Already rusting. Looks like a paint blob all the way down to paint that's soft. Tractor supply approved, apparently. That is just outrageous. You have to be kidding me on that. That is pathetic. Okay, we're back with some parts. Hope you enjoyed that rather disturbing video of uh, what some of the trailer manufacturers reselling or giving to people so let's get back to it
If you've gotten this far in the video, congratulations. If you found this embedded clip in the video, congratulations. Be the first person to send an email to the address on your screen, subject Best Buy Cards, put in the body of your email your address, and I'll send these two $5 gift cards to you in the mail. Okay, here we are in the truck and we're going to see how we get our computer put on here. We'll have to see how how well this does going down the road, I'm not too sure. This truck rides awful rough. 
but it's better than leaving my computer up here. Yeah. So far, not too bad. I like it. We'll see. Updates to follow. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And have a great day.